To the news now as an investigation of procedures at the Buffalo Veterans Medical Center continues. We're learning from Congressman Nick Langworthy that the focus may be expanded to review back even further how cases of cancer patients were handled at that facility. The representative says more senior congressional staffers from the House Veterans Affairs Committee and representatives from Congressman Kennedy's office recently visited with interim leaders who replaced the center's director and chief of staff. As we reported previously, Previously, there are concerns patients at the VA were not properly referred to outside cancer treatment hospitals with major delays. Uh, the Undersecretary of Veterans Affairs uh, made it clear to me that they will do a two-year look back and look for any other instances that we're not aware of. I mean, we, we have the between three and four dozen uh, instances that we're aware of. Um, they are contacting those families. They are finding out what the current status of those situations are uh, and where they are in their care plan. Um, and uh, if, if they're still with us, but also looking back and to see, was this a more systemic problem for a longer period of time? Congressman Langworthy says those new interim managers and staff are resolving the backlog of referral cases, and overall he feels the Buffalo VA Center does provide good patient care. Now, the Inspector General's reporter on this matter should be released by late September or early October.